there's so many different ways to go about being creative. But uh, what we're so excited about tonight is that these people are coming from over 6,000 miles away to show us uh, from their culture how they make beauty. And what Black Culture Project is excited about is rekindling a little bit of a spark and reminding us that we have this deep capacity to, to create culture and make beauty and make music and art and, and make things we are really proud of and that come from this place, from the trees around here, from the rivers around here, from the soil, and that we can make something indigenous to where we are from that we are super proud of. And so when we watch these guys, sharing with us this amazing beauty that's from their place, soak it in and use it to feed our own capacity to make beauty right here. Yeah. Sean will tell you really, really carefully about where exactly tuba is, because some people say tuba, what is tuba, where is tuba? He'll tell you about that. But I think what is most important is that they're grounded in the art of throat singing. And throat singing was the style originally originated by nomads, these nomadic tribes in Central Asia. And Alasha's members started training in this traditional style when they were children. So they've been doing it a very long time. If you will please help me welcome Sean Fur and also the group Alash. Tuba has its own Tuvan language. 